You should leave this place. Scales has brought a great evil into the palace. Do be extra careful. Sneak around corners by holding down L and moving the... Basically, it's just saying this here to move around. And apparently we have a subtract in the wall, but we can't really seem to get in. So let's tr go ahead and try blasting our way into the palace. So let's go ahead and grab us another bomb just up here. And yeah, these brains will respawn here. So... Basically, the best way to try and get around here is just to try and avoid the brains, and if you fall while carrying one of these, then you will let go, and it'll pretty much blast you as well. So, we'll just go ahead and get ourselves lined up here, and go ahead and break this. Bang! Yep, that worked. So, now we are inside, and what do we have over here? We have some, just some baskets, we'll go ahead and break them, and we have us more puck puck eggs. So, let's just go ahead and gather them up. And we even have us a little flying brain over here. So we'll just tr go ahead and try and avoid him and head on over here. And we have us more of these just in the way. So we're going to have to go ahead and blast them up. So we're just going to want to go ahead and get some distance. And hopefully we don't hurt this tri groaning triceratops here as well. There we go. And apparently we have us a new healing item here. What do we have? We have us a double stain. <clears throat> Pod. So this here is a delicious fruit, only found only on Dinosaur Planet. You will find them in sharp claw baskets and crates, or hidden in double dane trees. Even baddies will sometimes drop them. So these ones here are even better healing items. Basically, the puck bag eggs will heal about two <clears throat> two slices of health, and the puck puck egg will heal up a full part, as one would say for Zelda. Because the health thing is very much like Zelda right around here, and we even have another bomb over here. We'll go ahead and pick it up, because we are likely going to need it. We always seem to need a bomb. And you're going to want to be careful going through these flame swords. If you go and get hit here while carrying a bomb, then it will explode. And yeah, we even have us another crack in the wall, so we'll go ahead and break it. There we go. And there's another bomb. What are we going to need that for, I wonder? Well, first let's take a look around the room. No, any enemies or cracks, but what's this? Okay, there's another door, so we'll go ahead and head on over there. Hey! It closed before I could even get close to it. So, I guess we're going to have to use this bomb here just to put on a little weight. So, in order to put down and <clears throat> put down things, you have to not move, and then just simply press the A button, and then you will not throw it. So, let's go ahead and try hitting into here. Try talking to this fella. Kale Chrysala, Toot Uwe Kutsak, Kale Uwe Toot Wolf. Looks like Uwe Kale 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 Tash Kuk Shaduk. Neo no no ho Ukas Bai, I shot you cut for Kutsak. No no ho, which you shot. Like Neo no Uwe Tebo Kutsaho. Kale King Earthwalker. Shot each game. Hell cards cash. Shoot shot. Susuzo. Could see mo if Kale Crisola. Kale Crisola. Oh, Fuso Farhawks. Then over the road go. Kale Brado Cable K. Oh, Kuda. Now keep Kale Farhawks. A Kuda Ash too. Ash could so what Demo can add to pay. Morak, at Kokio Biho if could soak, so Kobo Keo Gash. Ut Kokio Krasoa Shrine, at Suacha too, so Koko King Bahad was caught, Ut Unawak Uwe Hunut, at Uwe Chisut, Kiot Hokit Kemo. <laughs> yeah, of course. So basically what he was saying is that he was explaining what this place is and gave us the introduction to the Crusoe Spirits and apparently one of them is just in this room. So we'll go ahead and head in here. And this here is the Crusoe Krizo Shrine entrance. So basically all you gotta do is just go walk on it and then press the A button to magically teleport into the shrine. So well, now we are inside the shrine, and now we gotta find us a Krizoa spirit. Take it to test and receive a good reward.
by the time you finish. So we are now inside and you just want to go ahead and head in. You have found your way into a Krizoa shrine, and within lies the Krizoa spirit. So you have the spirits that have been hidden, and they hold great powers. The power that is in the wrong host can bring power, da 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 da. But in the right hand, the spirit can bring peace. There are six spirits to find and return to the Krizoa palace. If you can find the spirit within this shrine, you can complete its task, and it will be yours. So we're just gonna have to go ahead and solve the puzzles in here. And if you're able to climb very high, then you can go ahead and press the A button and slide right down. I don't think it's going to do that. I'll show you one time when I'm actually going down. And apparently we have some more flamethrowers as well as the branches right around here. You just want to try and avoid all of this for now. Go ahead and fall down right there. Jump down or whatever you feel like and try and get up here. Of course, this little fella gives me a little smack. And what's this eerie looking gate? This is the Life Force door. Spirits won't know it. We'll tell you how many bad guys you must defeat before the door will open. Apparently there's one little nasty spirit flying around. And the only enemy we have is this flying brain. So, it's a little far from me right now, so it's just going to want to go ahead and wait for it to get a little closer and then give it a little bomb. And that'll open the gate. So, what do we have next? Let's see. We have us another flying brain as well as this, so you're just going to want to go ahead and head on over there. And you can go ahead and just try and avoid these if you can. You are time and you can see the gate is closing, but it is now right behind me, so no need to worry. We have made it inside. I got a little burn, but no matter. So let's go ahead and take this test and grab this Brazoa spirit. And this here is the spirit just right in front of us, so you're going to want to go ahead and talk to it. And I must say, I like the music in this game. Quite a bit of the music in here. Test one, the test of observation. So watch closely where I hide when the urn stops moving. You must show me which urn I have hidden in. Then find me three times in a row, and I will be yours to return to Krizoa's palace. So there's the Krizoa spirit. It is in this barrel. So you just want to go ahead and keep your eye on it for right now. The barrels will move around a little bit, and then it'll stop. And you just want to go ahead and touch the one that the Krizoa spirit is hiding in. I love this And as you can see, the scent barrel starts to get a little more, turn around a little more complexly. But no matter, you just want to keep your eye on the prize, as I like to say. And there's the Krizoa Spirit. So you just want to keep your eye on the prize. Just right around in there, don't need to move around, all you gotta do is just keep your eye on the prize. Over there, it's moving over there, and it is this one. And now we have us the Krizoa Spirit.
Oh, she did. Apparently, Sutton is watching her. traps are in there, but we don't know what, and sorry I wasn't really talking too much there, that was pretty much some of my favorite music in the game there that was playing there. Somewhere in, Los in the Lost Part of the Lilac System, it's Great Fox and here's Slippy working on Rob. Well, at least she doesn't sound like a girl anymore, just a, a bit of a squeaky, weird voice now. Hey, Fox! Isn't this music getting on your nerves? I'm trying to work on my back. Okay, old timer. Turn it down, Slippy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bye bye, Boombox, and now Fox and Reese in the light. Slippy, it's General Pepper. How are we supposed to do that? go to that were a part of the planet, but how the hell are we supposed to get these back to the planet? You say, well, apparently we'll try and figure out that part next time. But we have covered the prologue, so next time we will go down the dinosaur planet and see how we're able to do this. So, this is the Monster Triple One saying goodbye. I hope you like this LP series, and next time we will go ahead and start the main adventure. See everyone! <laughs>